All right, folks, Machine 88, and we are back. Playing Criminal Case on Facebook, we are wrapping up Case 3 of Elite Mode. Now, if you guys are watching this as of its release, you guys will be knowing that the next case is actually going to be coming out on Thursday. I'm super excited to play it, and let's unlock the additional investigation. Marshall Ace, you did splendidly with this case. I know it can't have been a great walk in the park, but you kept your cool and got to the bottom of things. Great job. Now I think you should check up on Mrs. Carter and Mr. Coletti. Both lost a daughter today. I don't want to make sure they won't do anything they might regret. And while you're at it, please go talk to 1-2 Sam. He's brought up some serious concerns about the homelessness camp safety. So, as before we talk to everyone, I kind of want to let you guys know, um, I am really enjoying going back to all these cases, so I very well may speak while I'm going through the other criminal case, basically in Pacific Bay, I may be replaying some of these cases just to, just because I enjoy them so much. Um, so that's definitely a thought of what I may or may not do. Um, after we talk to these guys, I will let you guys know some of my plans in the future. I still can't believe my own daughter could have done such a terrible thing. I haven't slept in two days. I see Jennifer's blood everywhere. Please, inspectors, could you inspect my warehouse and check there aren't any more objects tainted with her blood? Oh, of course, Mr. Cluddy. We'll be happy to look at all that blood for you. Oh. 6%. Oh, good. Just the people I needed. Look, between the Vipers and Marconi's henchmen, things are getting worse and worse. We have to hide everything we have, or those goons take it from us. I understand your frustration, Sam, but so far we haven't been able to pin anything on those guys. Huh, I'm not asking for that much, but I've heard that your pal here, Ace, is a crack at finding lost stuff, and I can't figure out where I've hidden my lucky gold tooth. You hear that, Ace? We've got a bit of a reputation. Don't you worry, Sam, we'll find that tooth in no time. It must be around that camp anyway. This is true. Hello, Mrs. Carter. Marshal Ace and I just came by to see how you were holding up. Oh, officers, you've got to help me. My sweet little baby will be buried tomorrow, and I cannot find her baptism medal anywhere. She needs to wear it for eternal rest. Oh, of course we'll help you. Ace's instincts never fail. We'll find your medal in no time. Don't you worry. Let's start by having a look at your kitchen. Let's do it. So anyways, guys, like I was mentioning, um, something that I'm going to do, probably not for this coming week's case, but maybe for the next week's case, I will be uploading that uh, blog. A vlog, actually. Um, and let me read this. Okay, Raul, can't be serious, can he? The place is covered with blood. How are we supposed to figure out which is pork and which is human? I'm relying on your instincts on this one, Ace. If you can find a human blood in this mess, it's you. Um, so with that being said, uh, we actually are doing some work on our backyard, like with a pool. So hopefully we by, not next week, but the week after, I can show some video of uh, our pool with the waterfall. I think it's gonna be pretty sweet. Uh, so this hair is nasty, uh, but where's the tat tattoo? Uh, eyeball, bullet holes. Um, so that's definitely gonna be coming up. And again, we'll be doing, um, my plan is to, is to upload that as a, uh, as a donator uh, thing only. So if you guys have donated, um, you guys will get to see that video first before everyone else. Um, and once that one goes up, I will make the one that went originally for everyone actually um, come up. So, or I'll show it I'll show it off to everyone. So there is a video that was released, I believe three weeks ago to people that uh, donated uh, to the main Pitching Ace 88 page as fan funding. So if you guys did that, you guys already know, which I think is about six or seven of you guys, um, but everyone else doesn't know. So that thing will come out pretty soon. See, what did I tell you? You've probably found the only object with Jennifer's blood on it. And um, since you found them, I'll leave you the honor of collecting a sample for Grace, okay? No problem, Jonesy. Let's just look at everything first, grab, gab, gabber, gather all of the clues. And then we'll just uh, investigate them all. I spent so much time on this one, I actually know where everything is. Uh, except trash can, I think it is the new one. Yep, trash can's new. Because I got 47, we got sock, dog dish, bra, foam finger, 
Missing persons, bottle, gloves, flashlight, cap, license plate is up here. That's right, gas bottles here, briefcase is here. Boom. Are you sure you want to search that trash can is? Your flare might not be as good after those fumes, you know. Oh, Jonesy. Jonesy, you crack me up. Jones, you're such a cad. My eyes are like green today. It's cool. All right, so we have, oh crap, cat, I don't know what that is, but CD, uh, broken metal is probably one of them. Yep, there it is. Uh, dish soap, chain, oh, there's mitten. I don't know where the chain is. It's probably back here. Poison, key, nail polish, button, bird, cat, I don't know what the cat is, light bulb, cutting board, man, I don't remember most of this stuff, there's that, the fan is up here, huh, oh, there's the cat, where's the chain? Oh wow, man! These cases were nuts back then, man. If you guys are, if you guys play these cases, I applaud you, man, because they are hard to find stuff. Hey Ace, I think you struck gold as usual. Well, I say gold, but what kind of cheap metal breaks into so many pieces? You cannot give the metal back to Mrs. Carter in that state. Ace, do you think you could manage to put it back together? Eh, I think I've got some skills. Hold, oh yeah, I forgot. In the newer cases, it's, they only go to two, but in this one, you actually have to find the three. Amazing work on those glasses, Marshall Ace. Let's send this blood sample to Grace and see what comes up. Start it. Open tablet. Let's examine the trash can. Probably gonna need to search for something, grab something, and then do something else. Oh, there's a gold tooth. Great job of finding this tiny tooth in that huge trash can, Ace. Let's go give it back to Sam, you're right. That was easy enough. Oh, fun. Fun, fun, fun. Man, these things were so much harder. <laughs> oh Lord. Oh Lord, won't you buy me a Mercedes Benz? All my friends drive Porsches. Wow, man, this is just, this is just brutal. Nope, nope. There, there's gotta be something else. Right there, right there. There we go. All right, we're getting close. That's not gonna go there. That's gonna do something like that, like that. Okay. This, this is brutal, man. Wow. Great job, Ace. This is indeed a baptism medal. Let's just hope it's the one Mrs. Carter was looking for. What's up, Sam? Here you go, Sam. One gold tooth fresh from the trash. Already? Huh. See, the guys didn't lie. Ace is really... Ace really is a crack. Thanks, Marshall. Hey, I helped a bit too, you know. Sure you did. The important thing is that you believe it. Pretty good at finding stuff too. Here, Ace, this is for you. Jaunty cap. Cool. Mrs. Carter, Marshall Ice has found and repaired this metal. Is this metal yours, daughters? It looks like it. Yes, my oldest daughter has the same. Let me see. 
Oh, I cannot read the birth date. How can I know for sure? Oh, my poor baby girl. Mrs. Carter, calm down. Marshall Ace is used to this kind of thing. They will decipher this birth date for you. Really? We didn't decide to look at that before we gave it to her? Hey, you guys. Gotta remember, this is only case three. So, Jones and I are not on... We're not so skilled. Holy crap. This, they did not give you much of anything on this one. Oh, I thought that was right. Oh. oh, they actually gave a real birthday. Pfft. Sorry, in the new cases, they don't even give you something like that sounds right. Well, I don't know how you managed to decipher these things, Ace. It all looks like gibberish to me. Let's show this birthday to Mrs. Carter right away. Uh, let's do it. Mrs. Carter, Marshall Ace has done wonders once again. Is your daughter's birthday 4-12-1995? Yes, it is. Oh, what a relief. Thank you so much, Marshall Ace. Now my daughter can truly rest in peace. Please, take this as thanks. Ooh, burger. Nice. Hey, we'll take a burger. Love me some burgers. Anyways, guys, see you guys in six hours. Pitch against 88. Au revoir. All right, folks, let's finish off this elite mode. We analyze the blood you collect from those glasses, Ace, and it comes up positive for the victim. But, um, I thought this case was closed. Uh, yeah, long story. Anyways, thanks, Grace. I don't know what Ace and I would do without you. Now all we have to do is go tell Raul about the glasses. Here you go, Raul. Here you go, Mr. Coletti. Those glasses were the only objects on which Marshall Ace found traces of Jennifer's blood. Well, thank you so much, Marshall Ace. If everyone was as selfless as you, maybe my daughter wouldn't have become a murderer. Well, unfortunately, we'll never know about that, will we? I guess not. Anyway, thanks again. Maybe now I'll finally manage to sleep at night. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. Ooh, baby. Ooh, we got a gold ring, yeah. Got a gold ring. Got a gold ring. Oh, snap. We're going to be getting four burgers from this. Heck yeah. So, I'll probably be doing some more elite modes uh, just because I enjoy playing some of the older cases again. like to, you know, check them out, remember them. It's been a whole bunch of fun doing it. But uh, thank you guys for all watching. This has been Pitching Ace 88. Over and out.